Hello guys, uh, I'm back, of course, but uh, I'm getting ready to go catfishing right now. Uh, ah, shit. The time is 4.50, and I'm going to be fishing from probably 6 o'clock p.m. to 8 o'clock in the a.m. Um, fish all night. I got four different kinds of baits that I'm going to be using. Um, I know they said to use sharp cheddar, but I'm going to go with the white cheese, the, uh, what do they call that, string cheese. And I got some hot dogs that I'm ready to put in some garlic. Oh, man. Yeah, that I'm ready to put in some garlic. I got a whole bag of garlic chopped up, whole clove. I also have some other bait that I made that is super, super stinky. I had to put it outside. Yeah, I don't know if you can see that. Ugh. Smells. But hopefully this works out good because I'm trying to dry it. That's why I keep it outside. Uh, but it's a mixture of rotten shad, uh, bread balls, and pizza crust. Believe it or not, garlic pizza crust. I hope it works. <laughs> and uh, my hot dogs are on the way. I got nice big hooks on here on my rod. This thing, look at that. This thing's ready. It's ready to roll. And this is my medium heavy rod. This is the one I use uh, strictly for business. Now I got my light tackle rod. You know, it's not very big, but gets the job done, you know. Now I got both of these poles rigged up in two different ways because I feel that having my hook on the end, you know, and then having my weight up further on the line, there's just something about that rig setup that just, I like it, you know, it's, it's for me. But I got my other one set up. It keeps the bait off the bottom of the water. Meh. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what to think of that setup. I'm I'm gonna try it tonight. And anyways, I hope it works great. I have. Sorry about that. <clears throat> yeah, I got mad confidence. I got headlamps. I got flashlights. I got my my chair. I got my refreshments. Uh. I have plenty of everything that I need to pull a overnighter at the canal. And honestly, I have nothing else to do. Nothing else to do at this particular time. So I'm going to hit the canal. I'm going to catch some fish. Maybe I might catch seven, eight, nine. Who knows? Who knows? I mean, really, in that part of the canal, it's real active. So I'm going to see what I can't get just tonight. I'm going to be fishing for the next three days, and uh, I'm going to see how it goes. You know, maybe next week down the line, I'm going to try to go trout fishing. Um, I used to do a lot of trout fishing as a kid, and so I know that it's, uh, it's easy. But fishing for striper and fishing for catfish you know uh, i've caught a couple catfish my largest catfish that i have ever caught my personal best was i think it was only like 12 pounds 11 pounds i had to think about it for a second but it wasn't very large you know i see these 90 pound cats these guys are smashing on huge cats and i know there's some potential 30 pounders in the canal in that section that i'm fishing in but uh if you're in the area or anything like that, you're more than welcome to stop by, say what's up, you know, give me a handshake, whatever, whatever you want to do. But uh, I'm going to let you guys go now because I got I got to handle some other business. Got to get all my fishing gear in line. <clears throat> but with all that being said, I hope you guys enjoy the video I'm going to post tonight for you guys. And I'm going to enjoy making it. I'll see you later.